What brought me to the Conscious Living Center was an interest in the Enneagram once I found out about it. I had recently lost my mother um, when I came to find out about the Enneagram and I was feeling very frustrated and lost and without a sense of security, um, <clears throat> which I mean, didn't know I was a six at the time, but uh, feeling like I'd had the rug pulled out from under me in all kinds of ways um, led me searching for a way to feel comfortable um, with myself. The changes that I've noticed in myself uh, since I've come to know more about the Enneagram um, and consequently know more about myself through it um, are that I, I can recognize when I'm reacting. Um, I know when I'm being gripped by fear um, or insecurity rather than identifying with that feeling um, or those thoughts, the paranoia, you know, I can sort of stop and say, this isn't me. This is, this is just a reaction. I used to get so stuck in these mental loops of, you know, what if this happens and then that happens and, you know, oh my God, there are so many things that just could fall apart and that doesn't concern me to the extent anymore. <laughs> Starting the School of Conscious Living has really brought a wonderful um, rounding to my experience with the Enneagram. It's added some more support for healthy practices. So going to that yoga class, going to that conscious cocktail party, and then coming to the center, you know, those were all steps that were getting me in touch with the community that I was looking for. So it's really grown my community of people that I'm in touch with now who are looking to better themselves and better their relationships with other people. This tool makes such a difference in your experience of living that I wouldn't, I wouldn't let anybody miss it.